Okay, so Bumba the Weird, and then complete the game for Bumba the Dead, and Bumba the em Empty requires me beating it twice with everybody. Well, let's try Bumba the, Bumba the Weird. So it's like part puzzle game, part deck builder, apparently? Yeah, kind of. It's also, yeah, it's like match three. It's also a roguelike. I don't know. This game is weird, and I'd say hard to classify, but I think it's actually fairly self-explanatory. Uh, holy shit, my stats are bad. How do we work with this? Move that over there. No, that doesn't really help me. I'm just gonna move these around. I am in trouble. Because I could teeth up. But that's not going to help me much. Okay, I'm going to do that. Let's goop him. Match that for a bit of extra energy. Add more of a selected tile. Go bonanas. Hoping for a bit more than that, but whatever. Gets me a bone and a tooth. Gets me an extra move, which is good. Removes tiles and throw, throws them. Pick a tile to throw. Bones? Oh, so it just did six damage. I get it. Uh, let's see. All right, I'm getting this. We're not in. We're not in as much trouble as I thought we would be. I, I thought we were we were up Poop Creek. Oh, that sucks. This would take a lot of rounds to get the this combo going. I'm just gonna set that. This guy's gonna get hit the barricade. I'll get a bunch of extra energy right off the bat. Okay, now what? I have a bunch of teeth. Chuck the tooth. I still got energy of plenty. Add more of a selected tile. Or remove tiles. Okay, what do we want more of? Poop. I'm gonna just drag that over now that I think about it. Whatever. That's that's a nice barricade. That'll keep me going for a while. Move these over. Set that up. Yeah, he ain't getting through to me anytime soon. The other guy, on the other hand, gives me the peepers. So I got two mana. I guess I'm just gonna go for a big tooth. Bammo! Okay, yeah, that's kind of worth it. Hmm. Go with just a regular bone combo? Yeah, alternatively, removes tiles and throws them. Oh, yeah. We need we need the we need basic bones to to chuck this. I'm a dumbass. Alright, whatever. Remove goo tiles. Chuck them! Yeah, so the removing tiles and throwing them is going to be nice. It's great for assassinating heavier enemies. Okay, pulls an enemy close or destroy a column of tiles. I guess I'll get that. Destroying a column of tiles is not exactly my idea of useful, but it could be. Ah, uh, hmm. Go for that. Add more... Add more bones. It was less bones than I was hoping for. Yeah, I'm just gonna do that. 
Now, if I'm not mistaken, I gain energy every time I kill something, and all of these guys are weak. So let's let's get some energy. Okay, so I'm gonna get shot here. I would like to avoid that. Okay, so this should give me two goobers. And we can destroy a column of tiles. End turn. It can't really do too much else. But yeah, let's just end turn. Now they're all going to hit me. This was ill-advised. Destroy that column of... That's all garbage. Yeah, I don't really have much of a response here. Oh, I am... I am going to get flogged. I guess let's just do that. That gets me a tooth. Kill this guy. Gets me one energy. Oop, that guy. Okay, let's remove all of the poop and hurl him into that guy's face. Okay. We're making sort of progress. Oh, let's see, I've still got one energy left. So, I'm going to just set it up for Bone Zone. I might be able to make this work. Because it looks like gooping an enemy just delays their action by a bit. If I can get my strength up to be kind of good, this guy would be amazing. There's a lot of reasons why this guy could be good. But getting there is going to be harsh. I'm seeing a lot of teeth here. In retrospect, teeth are like the worst thing for me to use. Because, yeah, cool, kill that guy. Shit. A lot of bones. I think I think this guy might take a mulligan or two before I really get him going. Because I'm going to get hit by several things right now. And there goes my soul heart. Oh, the fly just moved up. Okay, that would have been nice to know-ish. I'm probably just going to get hit by a lot of these guys. Let's see what I can do. Okay, let's poop up. Toss it in front of that guy. Remove slime tiles. Just smack him around. The deck management is not to be denied. There's some use here. Okay, I still have a move left do that. It doesn't add that much more. Okay. That'll that'll have to do. I like the board management that this guy presents. It's just his general frailty that is terrifying. 
Okay. And we're good. Curious whether you have anything to say regarding the whole Kappa and YouTube thing, or we don't talk about such things live. Oh, I don't mind talking about it. Uh, let's see. Destroy a spell or gain one man of each color. Ooh. Box would be useful. Price tag would be useful. I'm going to go box. Because we're up against loaf. So, honestly, unless things go differently, I don't think Kappa is going to affect me or most gaming YouTubers in the slightest. And anybody that tells you otherwise is probably just fear-mongering uh, for the sake of views or just as wildly misinformed. Um, let's see. Let's box up. Box up again. Keep boxing, and we're all out of mana, but that's okay. Let's see. Let's move this down. And this down. Okay, he's going to hit my poop pile. Not me, which is good, because I'm very vulnerable at this point. And there's there's all my bones. Uh, but yeah, like most controversies with YouTube, most people overplay it like crazy and don't actually look at any of the numbers, or even most of the facts, and are just like, It's the death of YouTube! But, like, I straight up got access to the Kappa tools today. Uh, Fool? Let's do the Fool. Let's see what happens. Uh, let's see. So I have 20 coins. Rerolling a spell would be nice. What about Mana Needle? That could be better. Oh, that's not as good as I was hoping it would be. This is Damage Needle. Yeah, let's just roll for a stat and hope for the best. Uh, but yeah, I got access to the Kappa Wheel. Well, not Kappa Wheel. Kappa C-O-P-P-A uh, stuff. Extra energy. You know, I'll take that. Uh, earlier today. And effectively, what happens is... It's straight up... Uh, you'll, you're asked, as part of your advanced options... It'll say, like, is your channel targeted for kids? And you say no, and then YouTube's like, cool. And then pretty much nothing happens. Because uh, effectively, Kappa is a, a system of policing YouTube against bad bad actor-like channels that say Elsagate, for, for an easy example. You know, these, these channels that exist purely to... Uh, purely to make, I'm going to say kind of scummy children's content in order to, uh, let's see, in order to not really trap. Let's add more teeth. Okay, let's, there we go. To effectively just get kids to click on it without even thinking about like, okay, this is risky. I don't want to do that yet, so why don't we use our last last bit here to set up some poop. There we go. Uh, to get kids to click on the video without actually... Ow! And I'm dead. I didn't realize they could still hit me like that. Well, let's retry try this guy again. Yeah, remember all that weird Spider-Man and Elsa stuff? Yeah, exactly. They're trying to get ahead of all... Well, ahead of. They're trying to create a system that is much more holistic at dealing with those really creepy... YouTube videos that, like, should have been dealt with a long time ago, but weren't. Um, and all it's doing is more or less making it so that uh, you determine whether or not your videos are child-friendly or not. And it'll change, like, ad rates and ad availabilities and stuff. But this is mostly trying to, like, kind of get a handle on that because it was too much. Um, it's kind of annoying that they're trying to be parents of kids. I mean, don't blame YouTube for that. That is 100% a U.S. government mandate, not YouTube trying to parent people's shitty kids. <sighs> Man, this is not a good pull right off the bat. Too many, too many enemies. I also just don't think I like... I like this character, but he needs... 
something slightly more aggressive for the first round or three. We'll go from there. But no, like almost every YouTube apocalypse, YouTube controversy has been for a result of like weird external for forces. Uh, either good for good or bad. Almost always because YouTube wasn't policing itself enough to begin with. Um, so specifically to, I guess, give context for this for people that haven't been paying attention, which one, I'd understand, it's not really a thing that most people would come across, but effectively... Effectively... Recently-ish? A lot of people have just been putting their kids in front of YouTube in lieu of proper education or even parenting and are like, yep, this is good enough. This this is the entertainment my child will receive. I'm just gonna get hit here again, aren't I? There's only so much I can do about it. I guess I'm just gonna put that there. Those two are going to get stuck on the poop barrier, but that's going to hit me. Um, but yeah, so people have just been throwing their kids on YouTube, and kids obviously have no idea how to protect themselves. Oh, I did this wrong, didn't I? Shit. I guess I'm... Uh, let's just try this again. Uh, but so you'll have a lot of kids just watching anything, you know, clicking on the first thumbnail that appeals to them, because they can't read and they have no idea what, like, a... what good or bad content on YouTube would be. So, you know, quite honestly, a child might see Bumbo on my thumbnail and just mindlessly click on it and watch this game about blood and poop and horror and actually, you know, not do so well. Obviously, that's the point where YouTube's like, okay, Time to separate the kids' content out to, like, kind of a different setup on YouTube. But then you end up with a lot of people that are kind of sneaking content in that's, like, for kids, but not. And it's just, I, I don't know, it's kind of a weird no-win situation, and I feel bad for YouTube. Because they have to... They have to deal with a bunch of people that are, like, putting out hours and hours of non-content, nursery rhymes and stuff. And the advertiser... I've, advertisers are coming in and paying big bucks, not necessarily for these kids, but because, you know, these are the most popular videos, but it's useless marketing. Who's who's actually going to buy a product because their, their eight-month-old was watching Nursery Rhymes on YouTube? And so what they're doing now is stepping in and saying, like, those aren't valuable, also those need to be reclassified so we don't get creepy shit. I think that's good. I still don't think it's enough, and I think they really need to sit down and, like, limit the platform so you don't have... Uh, let's see, what do we do? Teeth? Probably teeth. Uh, so you don't have as much garbage as we're currently looking at. This is... Mm. Oh, hold on. Okay, I'm just gonna do that. We're gonna just do a full teeth combo, because this this is a board clear. Should hit the lot of them. Well, that just net netted me a couple of things. And just kills everything. Perfect. Tooth combo. I don't know. Uh, blocks next next attack plus attacks or mallets. Let's splits a tile in two. Both of these are pretty good. I'm gonna do brown belt. We need defensive things. But yeah, I will admit I know next to nothing about this issue because again, it actually doesn't apply to me. Uh, as a just generalist gaming channel, my my content is oh. I started setting this combo up, but I realize I need to play a little bit more defensively or kill some of these things. Okay, so I'm just going to go kill one of them, and we'll just hope for the best. Oh, shit, I'm going to hit by three. That's... Oh, 
awkward. Let's see, I've got a tooth combo here. I'd like to move it over, but we need we need the teeth. Okay, I'm gonna just hit him for two. Let's remove slime tiles and bamo him. Okay, that gets me a little bit more. So I can pop the poop down. Okay, this is working out. I was worried. But I don't think I need it to be. Uh, let's see. I need teeth and bones if I want to pull this off. So what else can I do instead? I guess I could put a poop pile in front of him. That's some energy. Okay, there we go. It's a shame how many people on YouTube always got get hit in the crossfire. So, I'm gonna actually say once again, uh, a lot of people tend to talk about how, like, this hurts. Uh, we actually need this stuff, don't we? Um, how this hurts, like, innocent YouTubers and stuff. And I guess as a counterpoint, uh, my money went up after the apocalypse. Adpocalypse. Like, there was, there was a month where everything was, like, terrifying. And then after that, it was just like, oh shit, like, this is way better for me now. And I know it's not always the story with everybody, but, uh, you know, I was talking to my network earlier today, and they specifically had said, let's see, oh, so that's a counterattack, okay. So I'm gonna hold off on that for the next one. Uh, let's see. I've almost set up a full bone combo. Oh, let's see. But yeah, I was talking to my, my network earlier today, and my rep was more or less just like, yeah, you're probably going to make, like, you know, at least an extra 10% from all of this, because the advertisers are going to be allocating their money towards the things that actually, you know, will result in profits as opposed to just meaningless chi children advertisements, if that makes any sense. It probably does. Maybe it doesn't, I don't know. This is not a good game for me to be able to, like, rant about somewhat unrelated topics, because I'm constantly strategizing, but effectively, pick a tile to throw. Pick any tile. Pick the P. Chuck the P. There we go. But I, I will say as kind of a cautionary-ish tale for this, a lot of you guys do seem to be getting your information from people that specifically are... Uh, that are specifically putting out videos to fearmonger about this stuff, and that's never a good way to, to get information, because their... their... their business model, I guess, lives off of making you afraid and making you angry and whatnot. And it's not healthy. Uh, no, that ain't worth it. It's not healthy, and almost always they're going to cherry pick for the worst possible outcome. And so, like, grain of salt, every time I hear anybody talk about these these things, it's everybody super mad. There was the, uh, there was the uh, Markiplier situation a couple of days ago where a bunch of his fans got banned because of the bot situation, and YouTube was just like, no, we're not appealing, and then they actually had a human being look at it, and they're like, oh yeah, this is weird and wrong. And the problem is it's like too big of a company for its own problems. And so everybody was just like, YouTube's at it again with their draconian policies. It's like, nope, it's just their robots going on a murder spree and not realizing, oh shoot, yeah, this is not right. Because they don't know better. And even, like, word of mouth stuff. Like, I, I know you're saying you personally know people uh, that have this. I know so many people that have benefited from YouTube and uh, YouTube doing these changes. And so few people that have actually gotten, like, screwed over that it's hard for me to... Uh, 
believe. I don't know. Okay, this ain't gonna work. I'm probably just gonna gum this guy up here. Okay, so I, yeah, I'm gonna get hit. This is rough. So we've got slime. I guess if we do a poop combo here. Okay. We're gonna poop this guy. And we're going to black belt. Okay, an end turn. Okay, so they're doing mana drain. He hits the pile. I hit him back. Okay, I still have the capacity to do... No, they mana drained me. Oh, that's bad. Yeah, I think I'm in trouble here. These enemies are just, just a little bit too much. I like this black belt idea, but I don't do enough damage to make this work. I mean, I can kill one of these guys. Let's just let's just go for the single kill. Kill him. Then I'm gonna combo a P. I'm just gonna combo as many P's as I can. And let's add. What do we add? Let's add more bones. Hit him. Another bone. Take him out. Okay. I can chuck some tiles. Would not be a bad idea. Let's do that. I'm gonna just hit this guy. Because they're kind of rough. Okay, let's just set up for a seven bone combo in the next round. Because they're stealing my mana. There we go. That should help. Okay, we might be able to get this going. We might we might be able to pull this off. All right. Not dead yet. Okay, spells cost less for the room or knock back all enemies. Sleight of hand sounds interesting and very powerful if I can pull it off. The problem is, in the meantime, I might die. I'm gonna do it anyway, we'll see how it goes. Oh, the Duke! Okay, what are we looking at? So, easy win here is seven bone combo. Always. Luckily, we're looking at it right from the start, more or less. So let's just let's just go with this and just drop bones and hope for the best. I like it how it just specifically focus fires the boss to death. I love to know how to actually fight that guy, but whatever. More yellow tiles or more coin rewards? Do more yellow tiles. Okay, let's 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 spin the stat wheel because I don't have anything that's particularly amazing yet. Puzzle damage up, huh? Okay, uh, let's see. Do we make anything cost less, or do we reroll a spell, or oh, let's cancel that. Let's go back. Let's, uh, let's do spells cost less. Let's actually do that one. Maybe, and I can't do anything else. Oh yeah, so purple enemies are resistant to puzzle attacks. Good to know. So let's do that. Add more yellow. Do another of that. What else do we have? 
I am unsure. Adding more yellow at this point ain't gonna do me any, do me any favors. I'm not looking at much. So let's do add more teeth. Okay, that is looking good. Now I just gotta figure out how to leverage this. So if I do it that, the problem is they're all on one side. Actually, if I do that, it'll be okay. Let's keep adding more teeth. Oh. Okay, I guess I just get to eliminate one of these guys. The problem is their HP went up, and that puts me in a pickle. A uh, couple of pickles, because I kind of needed those teeth for things. Uh, I don't really know what I want to do here. Because it does seem like shooting for sevens is a bit of a winning strategy. Do that. Do that. Okay. And I can I can get a seven teeth on the next round. Not on the next round, the round after that. Oh, that's bad. I needed one more round to pull this off. Oh, what can I do in the meantime? because that ain't gonna work. I was hoping to get the teeth in position. I guess I'm just gonna do that. We'll goop him. He'll give me a bit. Nobody's attacking me yet. So, if I had a, if I had a poop. But we don't. I'm just gonna keep gooping this guy. We're gonna delay for a second. Drag that over. Okay, so drop the poop there. Hit him with a tooth. And then I'm going to block next to attack, and then attack. Okay, I have a shit ton of bones sitting around now. Well, let's move this around, maybe. Okay, let's do that. Let's end turn. Okay, so that guy misses, obviously. This guy attacks, but I karate punch him in the face. No one's going to attack me again. Whoops. Don't mess up. Don't mess up. Okay, we're good. None of them are hitting me. It looks like they're just scooting. Which is good, because now we can just super bone them. Unless, of course, this, co this triggers farts, at which point I die. Okay, it triggers farts, but it doesn't trigger the farts to actually hit me. And we get some key-ish. Not much. Blinds an enemy or splash damage attack. Splash damage attack. That seems like a perfectly cromulent idea for this specific section. So what are we looking at? A uh, bunch of piss. Which is kind of nice. I just got to figure out... Are there any specific... Because I'd like to get more than two, but I don't think I'm going to succeed at that. Let's just go for the first and see if we get anything interesting. The answer is no. Trigger that, we get extra moves. We can add more of it. Or... What else we got? We've got...
you've got five. I'm just going to do that for the time being. Well, nuts. Okay, so... Drop the deuce. Right there. I do, because I know these guys... These guys retreat, so if I... If I can hit... One or multiple of them. I guess, easy answer... Bones. More bones. Can't kill any of them, though. Which is hard to work around. Okay, so that's... That's bad. Obviously. Uh, let's see. So I have... Poop, I have no piss. Because I used it all. I think this is going to hit... Yeah, we hit the... Yeah, I think I'd die here. I don't know how many of those I can do, but I... Yeah, I'm dead. Okay, I have enough time for one more of these runs. So let's see if I can... Let's see if I can pull it off, or... You know what? Let's, let's go back to a different guy for a bit. We'll see how it goes.